Hello and welcome to another Traders Terminal video. This is Jordan and today we're going to talk about two things. First of all, is it really possible to make money from trading long run? All right, I'm not talking just about a week, a month, three months, six months. You get lucky, market fits your uh, trading style, you make money, right? I'm talking about long term. I'm talking about one plus year of my FX book proven results and I'm going to show you and prove to you that making money is possible long run. I have the MyFX book stats, I can prove it. I also have the videos and the ideas and the explanations proving that I'm doing the analysis live. And guys, trust me, it is possible. And I really hope this video, besides uh, throwing my website out there, is also going to influence you and motivate you to pursue your dreams. That might not be with me, that might, might not be with any of my softwares or any of the free stuff that I'm uh, putting out there. But in general, I want to show you that if you find the right path and the right way and the right method of trading for yourself, you will be able to make money in the long run. It's not going to be easy. Definitely, the statistics are against you, but it's possible. And trust me, if I was able to do it, 99.9% .9 of you are able to do it. So what you're looking at here is intraday account, huge risk, well, at least huge risk for me, based on the uh, dollar amount which I have there. Of course, this is uh, a relatively smaller account than an account which I would be trading long run and a bit more conservatively. This one is intraday, more aggressive. And the idea here is to grow the account as quickly as possible. This is why you're looking at such numbers. And I, I'm going to show you other numbers where the, the, uh, the statistics are completely different, right? It's all about the ratio. This is why uh, this thing is bored and you're not going to be looking at the dollar amounts, I want you to focus on the ratios. And the ratio I'm which I'm talking about is profit versus drawdown or drawdown versus profit. Basically, the idea for me is very simple. I want to have a ratio of one to one, meaning if I have 1% profit, I want to stick and keep approximately 1% drawdown. The higher it goes, the better, meaning 1% drawdown versus 2% profit, it's perfect. Now we have one to two, right? So as long as this ratio is approximately met, I'm happy with that. So uh, what we're looking at here is close to 35% of profit for this month, which is about to end, but uh, I'm pretty sure I'm not going to open any new trades most likely but even if i do open it's not going to influence that much the results and this is drawdown this is drawdown for the month you can see we have approximately 22 percent here right and now you, you start to understand what i'm what i mean by this ratio so if this is too much for you of course you can go ahead and lower it you can make it five percent drawdown six seven eight percent profit right it's all about playing with the numbers increase it decrease it just make sure it, it is in a range which is comfortable for you and your account size another thing we should be mentioning here look what's happening with the drawdown and this is also correlated to the volume uh, that i'm using in the beginning of the month we had some amazing conservative setups i'm going full force there i'm using my full risk and my full lot sizes i make money i start to decrease immediately why because i want to preserve whatever i have uh, done in the previous trades and i want to have a positive month week year whatever the period is that you're counting okay in my case i'm counting monthly so once i have a good period or good few days few weeks few trades, I know I can now decrease because now I have enough capital to support whatever I'm going to do with that. That could be withdrawing for bills, that could be um, leaving the capital to grow the account, depending on the goal. 
but this is how I usually do it. Okay. Now, don't get me wrong. If it starts the opposite and I start with negative, uh, like it goes to minus, right? This is drawdown. Maybe we should show this. So let's say this is happening. And this is the very first trade you're getting. I'm not going to go full force after that or double or triple the account size. Uh, sorry, the risk size. No. Okay. It goes only in one direction. If you have big profit, then you start decreasing. This is how I do it. I'm not saying this is the only way. It's just how I do it. Uh, so how do I make all these trades? Um, what's my trading style? How do I analyze the markets? Well, instead of explaining you in theory how it's done, uh, what I did here is open these trades. So basically, if you go to traderstermina.com under the trading ideas tab, you will see this thing here, okay, this list. And up until today, this was locked because you have premium and you have free trades here, okay? But what I did today is I unlocked everything which is not active. So basically, if you see not active, this is the status of the trade. If it's not active, you're now able to click on that and see what's happening. And as you can see, I'm not logged in. I can click on that and now it will take me uh, to the actual video and to the result. So I want you to go ahead and see the way I'm trading, okay? It's not, well, let's say not super simple, but it's also not that complex. I'm using very native tools, if we can call them that. I'm using levels, I'm using fibos, and I'm able to achieve these kind of results, okay? And I've been doing that for years and it works, guys. And for me, the most important part here is to be able to understand that this works long term. It's not short term thing, right? So please go ahead, check out uh, all these premium and free ideas. You have the results. You can watch the video. You can watch the ideas. You can see how I'm thinking. You can understand my methodology. And if you have any questions, of course, uh, drop me a message. Find me in Telegram, Skype. Whatever it is, no problem. Video here below, comment, I will get back to you. But it is possible. And now I said that I'm going to show you uh, long-term proven results. And I'm not joking, guys. Just go to myfixbook.com slash member slash quizical. I'm going to post this link below in the description. And you will be able to find um, this trick here. They're public you can go ahead and check them out. Ignore this, this is from strategies, this is backtest, this is not a realistic expectation, okay? Uh, it's just for analysis. But this, this is realistic. And here, for example, you can see one of the accounts and you can see that this thing's been working since March 2017 until August 18th. Right? This is more than one year. Look at this curve. It is definitely possible. Here it is. You have 9% versus 30%. What's the ratio here? Does it make sense? Okay. And again, look at the numbers compared to the previous account. This is much more uh, conservative approach which, with lower risk. As I said, it's all about the preference. Okay. Uh, then you have another account. Now, the crypto, this is a bit wild, if we can call it that. And I wouldn't really uh, expect such, such numbers unless you're doing some very, very small, tiny account where you're doing experiments. Crypto is extremely volatile. I wouldn't be using that for uh, living or for my... I don't know. It's just... I wanted to see if my trading style works on crypto. I put a, like set up a small account. It proved it works, okay? But this is not something I'm doing on intraday basis. This is not something I'm paying my bills with. All I wanted to say is it works, okay? This is a shorter period of time, November till January, just a few months. 
it works. And as we can see, volatile, volatile, volatile. I wouldn't really put too much money there, but uh, the question was, can we prove that this methodology that I'm using in my trading methods are working on the crypto markets? Yes, they are. Now you have another account here, which is slightly different from everything that I'm doing. And this is called investment. With investing, what you're doing is, um, basically you're trading daily and weekly charts, sometimes even monthly charts, and you're holding for longer periods of time. What we can see in general in the Forex market is that the market is trading in a range. I'm talking about the whole period of the Forex market, okay? The absolutely whole period of the, the Forex market is going in a range. This is not a stock, this is not an index, it's not going in a single direction over time. So knowing how to apply certain methods, you can be extracting money in this specific way. Now, this is completely different and you will see that the drawdown here is completely different from the intraday strategies, okay? So some people like it because this is almost um, no maintenance, you check out the charts probably once a week and that's it. So some people prefer it and the only thing here to know is how to manage uh, your risk and how much of your account are you willing to put on risk to, to accept the drawdown in order to make money. I'm pretty comfortable with what I'm doing and as you can see, I had a few larger drawdown periods like this, 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 right? But if you know what you're doing, at the end of the day, you're making money. So this is totally different from the intraday. And that's why you need to be able to put this money at risk, right? This is why the drawdown is larger, because if you're playing the, the conservative game with the stop loss and 1% and 2%, etc., you will not be able to do that. So this is completely different story, but still long term, you are able to make money and the graphic is growing. So I really hope this is, um, again, at least a bit motivational, at least a bit giving you clarity. Of course, there are people who are much better than me. Of course, there are people who are doing it, doing it in a completely different way. There are people who are slightly worse than me. Trading is one of the best jobs, if we can even call it a job. I mean, I wake up every morning and I go to the chart and I analyze and I simply love it, right? So if, if this is your thing and you're passionate about it, do not give up. It's absolutely possible to be done. You just need to be consistent. That's it. All right, guys, if you have any questions, um, comments, and I'll get back to you. If you like this video, please thumbs up and I'll see you in the next one.